If you want to have a website or a blog, but you don't really have a, a budget for this, for example, it can be looked similar to, you know, like what I'm doing, but in your brand identity with your type of content. So if you want to create something similar to this without paying money, I'm going to want to introduce you Tumblr, a social media platform that can help you create a blog. So let's start by looking at it. So when you look at this up here, right? Um, you look at this, how it looks, this is the main page. Here is the home page. That's how you come to. You connect to this. You can either with your Gmail or whatever. Whenever you want to post something new, um, you're going to click here on the right side and it's going to give you a different option. And if not, it's already up here as well. So the different options there are is either to add a text, right? So you write a title, you write a text. And you're going to do the hashtags. We're going to show you quickly uh, after I'm going to show you the different ones. The second part is, of course, you can add a photo here as well, either from the web or to upload one. Uh, but not only that, the nice thing is, it's like here when you see this quote. So it's like this here. You click here. You just write a quote. You write the source and you add the tags, which is amazingly. As well, you can share links. All right. You put the link. And then automatically, no matter what link you're going to put, it's going to put the text in and it's going to present you. You can again, audio, video, and you can even start like a chat, presenting like you're having a chat. So let's say, for example, if you want to do it as testimonials with clients and things like this. So for example, I'm going to take the link, right? So let's do the link. I'm going to open it and I'm going to do the copy paste of the link. For example, let's say I want to promote this. You will see that automatically it's taking the title from YouTube. It's taking the even uh, the upper part of the text. Then I can write here whatever I want here. So I can say, once you can also play with the text here, you can see you've got the different options here. And then you go to the tags. You don't even need to put the hashtags. So I can write here, for example, um, let's say YouTube. And then I just choose the things, social media. Um, I can choose the different ones that I want. And when I've done my hashtags and you can put it here even more, um, you click on post, but you do have the options to either add it to the queue, save it as a draft, post privately to schedule it. And you can also link your account to Twitter. So for example, mine is a link to Twitter. So once I'm going to post here, it's already going to be posted as well on my Twitter account, which is nice. So it's kind of helping you to save that job. Um, if you're not sure why to use it as well, I do have a video on that topic uh, on why to use Tumblr, but if I'll go back. So once you click here on your icon on the left, you see if I'm gonna stand, it's gonna open my blog. So I'm just gonna click here, it's gonna open my blog on the side and you will see that on each and every item, I'm gonna have the sharing part, I'm gonna have the comment, I'm going to have the like to turn it to the, uh, to the bean, edit it. And this one, it's a nice one because it's to reblock it. So the way is you've got on Twitter retweet, that's what you do here, reblogging it. So you can do it also for others. So let's say I'm going to go here for home. You can, of course, follow each uh, other people's accounts and you, they can follow you. So for example, um, if I'm going to find here something that I like, Okay, so let's say, for example, I want to, I like those, like, um, for example, quote, or it's whatever other type of content you like. You see, this one got 640 notes, which means people give it a like. I can click here on the reblog. And by doing that, I'll be sharing it on my page. And then I'm going to click here on the reblog, and I can add the tags. And that's the nice thing. You can take content from others and use it for yours. So it's a great tool. And again, as you can see, it will take it again to my Twitter because it's all linked. I will see here as well if people are sending you messages, emojis, um, you can click here for the information, see how many likes you receive, followings, different settings, your followers. Uh, so all of this information will be here on the side. And it's just a nice tool to have. And again, if you look here, and I'm gonna refresh it, I actually created to myself a mini website, a mini blog with all my content that people can come and create and connect. And I link it to the different accounts, uh, for example, from Instagram that I've got, to my podcasting and stuff. 
So you can do it as well. So why not? Huh? It's a great, it's a nice tool. It's a social media platform. It's a place again to connect and to engage. So use it to grow your business and to reach out to more people. I really hope this video was helpful. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I'll see you in my next videos. Bye.